putting my light on for you. See that right there? Some spray paint and a massive cock on the seats on the fucking staircase. Done a pretty good job of it as well, if you ask me a lot. Plenty of old bobbies about tonight. Yeah, bro. Yeah, I got a lot for you. Want to be in my video? Yeah, you're well, in it. What? What's, What's your name? State your today, name. Babe. State your name. Kevin. Uh, Christian. Peter. John. No. Yeah, bro. Be careful with that. It's an okay. antique. That. No, no, there's no, there's a video. He's enjoying nice, himself, yeah. isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Hey, some people know how to live life, man. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> Came here and uh, took a piss at this big building and uh, chewed in my piss. But that's not what I'm on about, though. If you listen real closely, you can hear an alarm going up. Did you hear that? So someone's probably fucking, I don't know, busted something, robbed something. Anyway, I'm hanging around in the general area. <laughs> So I'll let you know what happens. Here we are, currently outside the uh, Tesco's. Cause it's a nice, well-lit area. It's a little bit windy. Don't mind the wind. Yeah, man, it'd be sick if everyone turns into like hippies and that. Nah, just because back to like the 60s and that. You know, it's like a bit bait sitting outside of a supermarket and that. Just in case, like, uh, please come here to get yourself a little cornet or something, you know what I mean? While they're working the night shift. But, like, uh, being in a position like this, they could literally walk straight past you. Not even really look at you. It's just that, like, blatant that it's almost no one would be doing it, so they're not thinking to look for you, are they? Like I said, it's no big deal now, anyway. Worst case scenario, we'll get a little fucking little slap on the wrist. Might start dry, fucking lick the end of the joint and it didn't stick. I'm just doing me, you know what I mean? It's only a bit of cannabis, isn't it? I was actually in their go-karting today. I think it's the first time I've been back open, you know? Since all this business. Oh, and well, I'm sure they won't mind me having a little smoke for smoke. Still could piss last time I was down here. Just making sure that no one's pissed all over the bench or something. Them lads that uh, come up and ask me for the lighter, they're from Skegness, yeah. That's a sign, man. I've been saying I want to go out there to go make a video and that. I think that would be the shit, mate, go around skating. I just want to talk to some of the locals and that. Ask them what they think about the place, you know what I mean? Maybe even hire a donkey or something. fucking an editing software so I can get rid of that key master, coin master thing up in the top corner of the screen because that shit has been there on every single one of my videos and quite frankly they've had enough free publicity off me I'm done with them you know I was on about like, everyone being like hippies man that's got me thinking about Forrest Gump that's a bad boy film that is man I got a fresh patch of tobacco. <coughs> it needs fucking airing out a bit. <coughs> it ain't tasting too good. <coughs> Still going up.
still no one in attendance. We'll have a little inspection around the property, make sure that it's not been damaged for them. Everything seems to be in order. This place, man, we need to put some lights on down here, man. Stingy bastards, man. Oh, you boys, peace and love, yeah? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you saying? This is. <laughs> I ain't interested in this business. What are you boys saying? You having a good night? I was born in. 2000. Oh, no, sorry. It's 2012. I was born in 1988. <laughs> I'm 33 years old. I think you're angry anyway, bro. You're good. Not angry, mate. Not angry with nobody. A police officer just jumped out of the car and got angry. Yeah, I've been stood with 12 police officers right here. here. Police officers just there over no, the road. I'm the only fucking fat police officer there. Taking it off you. Kenny, is that your name, yeah? I'm a fucking rape daughter and myself in hospital. Got my bank card. We'll go fucking. I'll give you a tenner for a good story, bro. Literally, you know that, that finger there, yeah. That finger right there. Yeah. You see that mark there? Yeah. And you see that mark on this side? It's got to be a fucking yeah. good story. I want a good like five minutes out, yeah, yeah, at least, bro. I got paid forty quid, yeah, to get shot in the hand with an air rifle, gas air rifle. Come on, bro. Is that what you got for me? You got more than that. Literally, that's the only story, bro. That's the only story you got that's for. Come on, story, tell, me, what, tell me about your life. What's your home life like, man? What? My you home got life, I'm, I'm home brothers, home sisters? No, I've got brothers and sisters. I don't see none of my family at the minute. Ah, come, man. Just because just of drugs and that. I've literally, because of that. When I was 13, I took my mother and basically fucking. My mum kicked me out for it because she didn't want me in front of my little brother and sister. And that that mamba's a fucker, bro, I tell you. I don't even smoking it, man. What about seven years? I will tell you a shake. You had it tonight, look. No, I had it Fucking. I tell you what, I do this thing as well. It's called Aimless Eds or Tails, yeah. yeah. Fucking, uh, you get free flips, innit? Yeah. You get everything right. I normally just give them quids, innit? So, yeah. like, you get everything right, you get free quid, like, yeah. but fucking. Keep it going, bro, anyway, because this is what people like, they like little interviews and that. Yeah, but we got more of my going mad. Do you know him? Yeah, yeah. Your pal? yeah it's, it's Kenny. Kenny. Do you know him around here? Like, yeah, he's a, he's a pisshead. He's just started on two black lads up where he has. He's homeless I'd, as well. He used to have been sat out there all night. Like, yeah, all night. Him, yeah. It's fucking yeah, yeah. <laughs> nuts, isn't it? He come off asking for some back I said, yeah, mate, he can have some back here. But I thought, I'll put my camera away because he looks like the can't get his back to pull out a blade or something. <laughs> Trying to bite his right door. Yeah. That shit out is you, isn't it? Fucking wrong, innit? I don't even want to know if. Too many wrong ones around here, mate. It is, honestly, it is. Alright, let's go get some fucking change. Is that a 24 hour shop? Where's yeah, that? It's literally around the corner, but. What's your name again, sorry? Nathan, Nathan Lewis. Go on then, tell me about your criminal history, Nathan Lewis. Criminal mate. history, basically, uh, I've, I've been in jail from the second start with a blade. Take me back to when you was younger, first, first, first conviction. First conviction was criminal damage when I was 13, and basically I, I smashed a window in my car home when I was living in a car home. And and you had called police on you, that, yeah? Yeah, I called the police, I got arrested for it. Scumbags. Yeah, after like, that? After that, basically, fucking uh, common assault. I smacked, I smacked a lad in the care home. A lad who was living next door to me and that got kicked out of that care home. Yeah. Basically, basically fucking, uh, I got I got second sight with a blade. And I got loads of convictions. I got criminal damages. Got. What's your most recent one, man? Most recent one is criminal damage. For what? Uh, basically, I was going to, uh, 
rob a shop and basically um, they locked me in the shop so uh, and smashed the, uh, smashed the bottom uh, glass board in and the Trying shop. to get out yeah. and that. Did you get out? Yeah. yeah Fair play to you, bro. Yeah. Yeah. I'd like to see the CCTV for that. What shop was it, man? Shell garage. Oh, yeah, what? Up that way? Yeah, up up top, up. yeah, fucking hell, man. Yeah, I'm liking this shit anyway, it's good, man. What I was going to say, yeah. Uh, fucking. What, you done time, have you? Yeah, I've done six months in jail, bro. Just just the one time, yeah? yeah. just one time. That's all right, then, man. I got, I've been recalled twice. Two week recall for missing probation and shit like that. Yeah, man. Shit, though, a few minutes, man. Yeah, man. How long have you been out here, lot? Seven years, I'm only 19, so. You're only 19, yeah? Fucking hell, you look older, man. Uh, in September 11th, 2000. Yeah, fucking hell, bro. What's gonna say, man? Uh, yeah, that's about all I need off you. That's a good little interview right there, man. Yeah. Knife in the Street Love documentary, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what was that name? Fucking name. Kenny. Kenny the Madman as well, yeah. We need to get in for an interview, don't we? Yeah, we do. <laughs> Maybe when he... if you do an interview. Yeah, what, is he knocking about tonight, is he? Yeah, he is. Yeah, we'll go see him in a bit, innit? Yeah. We'll go get your tenor out, bro. We'll go see our fucking Kenny, innit? There you go, me man. Oi, one last thing before you go, yeah? yeah. Where are you going to spend the money on you? I will tell you, uh, we'll grab a member with a father and then... That's uh, one father, yeah? Yeah, and then a father on food, bro. Fair play to you, brother. Oi, I respect for that, man. Thank you for that. Bro. Yeah, enjoy your night. Just do your thing, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah